We have the muscles of the posterior pelvis and thigh. Let's begin at the back of the pelvis and look at the gluteus maximus muscle. The gluteus maximus muscle obviously is very large, and next to that, and slightly lateral to it, we have the gluteus medius muscle. Now there is a gluteus minimus muscle, but think of it this way. The gluteus minimus is minimal, or so small that we can't actually see it, and we wouldn't be able to see it without first taking off the gluteus maximus muscle. We're gonna move down into the hamstring muscles at the posterior thigh, and there are three hamstring muscles. There's the biceps femoris, and then going together is a semimembranosus and semitendinosus muscle. Well, we see that there's only one muscle here by itself, so this must be our biceps femoris. On the other side, we have our semimembranosus and semitendinosus, and in order to determine which is which, look for the tendon. We see the tendon on top here, and the tendon goes with tendinosus. So this top muscle is semitendinosus. Beneath that is a wider muscle, semimembranosus.